What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. If you guys missed the last episode, it's going to be in the top right hand corner. Go check that one out if you haven't already. Today's episode, we're going to be doing the Childhood Sweetheart Quest. So sit back, relax, chill out for a bit. If you do enjoy this one, a like would be greatly appreciated. Also, if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that noti bell so you don't miss any uploads. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter at 808 Black Mamba. Let's get right into the episode. It was down here somewhere. Let me just Ooh, walk past that guy. Frick, hold on. Oh, it's over here. Excuse me. I'm just getting one of the these. The last house in Molden. All of it should be here. What is this guy doing? What is this man doing, huh? Enough mall that no one enjoys hijinks more than me, but due to the number of oil based fires, I cannot, in good conscience, allow unlimited access to such incendiary material. Therefore, all oil jars in the village have been collected and placed under lock and key. If you behave like a ch behave like children, you will be treated as such. Your exasperations, brother Thomas. Oh, there's something to look at in there. Someone was interrupted preparing the supper. Taken or fled. Hmm. Right there. A second bed. Olvida doesn't live alone. What are you doing? Leave me be, warmonger! You have my sister! Is that not enough? Peace, boy. I'm not with these men. I came to speak with your sister. That's all. A day in Essex. Now, here's a day riddled with strange portents and happenings. What is your name? I'm Ellerich, the man of this house. Who are you? And why have you come? I'm looking for your sister at the behest of another. Behest? I've got no money to speak of, and my sister is well past the marrying age. Do you know where they're holding Olvida? Yet another stay at the King's pleasure. The prison camp at Brentwood, far to the west. I'll bring her to the lake house north of there. Meet us there if you wish. If you promise you will find her, I will. I'll find her. Damn it. Mm. Mm. Fuck it. That's enough. Let's battle. Oh my god. I'm on fire. Battle. Where did this guy come from? Oh, 
Okay, the key from this guy. You hear the commotion earlier, buddy? Buddy old pal? Is it gonna turn right there? Gonna sit right there? Why, thank you, my good sir. Whoopsie! This must be Birsten's love, Alvida. They haven't broken her spirit. Hello. Come with me. What? Why is this? You're not one of them. Stay quiet. I'm here to free you. I cannot walk. My ankle. They were not gentle with me. Then I will carry you. Who are you? Who risked so much to save me? A friend. Oh, Damn it, I can't make it out there. <laughs> Is he all right? The poor boy. Not your brother. Can I even climb anything? A no. Oh, here's a back door. Let's get on out of here, miss. We're here. Bless the saints. Here you are. Sir. Rest now. Soon you will be up and about again. Alfida. Did they hurt you? Takes more than some cockshy milksops to break my will. Beating a boy after death for stealing bread. I'll not see it done. Growling bellies mean nothing to those pay swords. Ellerich, pay more mind to the world. It is cruel and dark for those who cannot stand up for themselves. Alvida, could we speak in private? He is a good boy. But without a father to guide him, he's grown softer than I'd hoped. You raised him alone. Where were your parents when he was a child? Dead of the plague that came when he was three months born. So to shun your door when you have a babe on your teeth. Now it's your turn. Why did you come for me? I am here at the request of Elderman Beerston. He wonders if you could love him again. Love him? Dear old Beerston, he remembers. He does. Oh. I thought of him sometimes myself. <laughs> but with my brother to fend for... I could not waste a life mooning. He has thought of nothing but you, Alvida. And with his wife, Estrid, returning to Frankia, he sent me to find you. How it would work between me and him? I'm a poor woman. Have been always. But the elder man... Oh, God, help me! I'll give him a go. How could I not? Oh, bless. He'll come if you call. At the lighting of the bonfire, he'll ride here to meet you. Ellerich, come you and sit with us. I have something to say. Here he is. My... my apple blossom girl. Is it really you? It is. Though crows have left their footfalls around my eyes. They still shine brightly, as when we were children. Has Eivor told you all? Aye, she has. And do you accept me, love? My heart feels like it will burst. And this young lad is Elorich, Olvida's brother. Hello, your... your... worshipfulness? I am Beerstadt, nothing more or less. And you are a fine, strong lad of... How old? Nineteen summers. He's all the family I have, Bairston. 
If I'm to stay, you must welcome us both into your heart. We have one half of our bargain done, Birsten. I will return with news of the other. Does this mean we're leaving Malden? You are, my boy. To live with me in Colchester. Perhaps I can teach you the joy of the hunt. Before you go, Elridge, I'd suggest a long, slow walk around the lake. I should leave them to their reunion. The next piece of this drama is the kidnap in Colchester. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. If you guys did enjoy it, a like would be greatly appreciated. And I'll catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace out.